Many of us West Aussies have fond memories of spending our childhood school holidays on the foreshore of Rockingham Beach. The foreshore has recently had a $15 million upgrade, which has transformed the area into a bustling meeting place filled with colour and shade. The food scene is amazing here too, with waterfront dining, cool cafes, upmarket sports bars, wineries and a brewery. The Rockingham foreshore really does have it all. Today I've come for the sun and the glorious seafood. I'm going to be cooking this amazing pink snapper caught just out there on my trusty hibachi. You don't need to bring your own barbecue because there are plenty scattered right along the foreshore. So first up, we need to make the marinade. We're going to start with the zest from one lemon. I'm just going to peel the outside of this lemon down because everything's going to go inside the mortar and pestle. Chop it up a small amount. And in. So the ingredients in today's marinade are onions, garlic and chilli, capers, salt and olive oil. The reason why we're using these flavours is they go very well with fish and seafood. Capers give a real nice vinegar salt character to it, the lemon gives that citrus burst and we all know how well garlic and butter go together. Okay so now this is ready to go, time to score our fish. Take a sharp knife and we're going to cut about a half a centimetre slash down through the skin on a 45 degree angle. We're going to do three on one side, turn it over, and then we're going to do three on the other side. So now it's time to rub the marinade in. Just get this beautiful marinade, rub it all over one side. Make sure you get it inside the cracks. Turn it over, and then some again on the other side. To stuff the fish today, we're going to be using some really, really aromatic herbs. We've got some fennel tips here, some basil and some parsley, and of course the lemon. But you can really add anything you like. You could add tarragon and dill, you could add Thai basil and coriander. It all depends on the flavour of the fish you're looking for. So now it's nicely marinated and packed full of all those beautiful aromats. Time to put a nice big fat knob of butter on top and we're going to wrap it up. So now it's all tightly wrapped, time to pop it on the hibachi. Now this is the hard part, knowing when the snapper is actually cooked because it's all wrapped up inside. So you really have to take a punt on yourself. But the key to knowing that the fish is completely cooked is the meat will come away from the bone very easily and you'll be left with just the skeleton. So here you have it, gorgeous pink snapper, caught here, cooked here and eaten here, right on the Rockingham foreshore. Doesn't get any better than that.